You know, we've talked about the importance of energy efficiency for decades. Why is that conversation different today? Well, Tracy, you're right. For more than 100 years, we've been focused on making a better motor. And that's one that uses less electricity. And that's always been important because electric motors are everywhere. They are essential to the way we live today. They really do keep the world turning. But the conversation is different today because the world's population is growing faster than ever, which is a driving a higher demand for electricity. And the impact of that demand on our climate is becoming evident. So how can industry be part of this new conversation and how can they lead the effort to actually reduce the electricity they consume? Globally, electric motors consume almost 70% of electricity used in industrial applications. And in fact, 45% of the world's electricity is used to power electric motors in buildings and industrial processes, including data centers, steel factories, food processing plants, and packaging centers. Unfortunately, most of the electric motors installed today in those facilities are outdated and inefficient. By implementing new technologies and industry best practices, energy efficiency can be improved by up to 20 to 30 percent. So are there any particular applications where energy efficient motors are even more effective? Well, fans, pumps, and compressors are an easy place to start. 70 percent of the motor market are these three applications. You'll find that many of these motors operate most of the day, kind of like a race car, full speed. However, it's important to consider a variable speed solution that only uses the amount of electricity when it's needed. What do you think the next step in regulation should be? Well, I believe we have done the right things with regulation to this point, but now I think it's time to take a different direction. We are fortunate that our technology has outpaced the regulations, and the minimum standards are a good basis of which to move forward with. But we need to help users understand that it's okay to replace a working motor with a new technology. We would prefer to work with our customers to make these changes on their own rather than to have more regulation mandated. Any last words for us today? Well, reducing electricity consumption is, is good for our communities. It's good for our businesses and the earth overall. By choosing to invest in new generations of motor technologies and reducing the amount of electricity we consume, we can immediately start creating a sustainable tomorrow today.